hello everyone so let us move ahead with the reading for today and let us just wait for the cards to jump out as and when they jump out in whichever sequence so please give us a reading for oops <laughs> sorry uh, too many cards jumping out so let us just wait for one card to jump out and i guess this card wanted to show itself so let us just wait for one more card to come up and all right once again there are lots of cards so maybe you have a lot of questions in your mind right now uh so i would suggest that you sort out one of them and whatever is the most pressing matter to you at this moment and i think one more card has revealed itself so let us just go ahead with the reading for this card and let us open them one by one so the first card that we get over here is the 7 of pentacles seven of pentacles over here it's an upright card and you can see that these gold coins they are like um they are like heaped up in a pile there are too many of them and this man he's standing over there and he's just looking at them and it's like he's wondering what to do with them so it's like you are getting gifts from above in bounties there are lots of gifts and blessings coming to you it's just that maybe you still do not know what to do with them so it's like it can be a little bit overwhelming at times where uh, you are unsure about what to do with these gifts that you are getting or these blessings that are coming to you or things are happening too much in your favor so it kind of overwhelms you and let us just check out the other cards as well okay so this is the 10 of cups so it's like whatever you were aiming for whatever you have dreamt of all of this is rainbows the beautiful card this 10 of cup it talks about completion so it says you can see a family over there and they are everybody is content and they are playing children are playing the couple is standing over there with their hands spread out wide and this 10 cups the complete cup of your wishes this this is fulfilling all your wishes so as i said now these pentacles there are too many things that were there there are so many things so many more things that are coming your way which are going to really really fill up your lives and let us just look at the knight of wands over here so whatever you were aiming for whatever you had set out to do whatever had been your plans for a long time it seems that things are happening too much in your favor at this moment so it's like this person is confused about what to do and over here it's like even more is coming your way so do not just keep getting confused about this keep moving ahead keep enjoying your things whatever gifts are coming to you whatever blessings are coming to you there is much much more to come ahead so do not be overwhelmed with them just learn what you are supposed to do with them and over here we see the knight of wands the knight of wands is like it's ready for action so it's ready to move and uh, it's like all right so i am he's on the horse and he is ready to take some action there's all right i am on a mission over here uh there is a long exciting trip going ahead but see this is reversed so it seems that all these things that have been gifted to you that have come to you as blessings uh all these things they are overwhelming you a lot and this night is reversed it says that because you are so overwhelmed you are suddenly kind of inactive or you are apprehensive about how to act and where to take all these things what to do with all this so it's like at this moment you seem overwhelmed 
with whatever is coming your way so it is uh, causing you to be be a, a tad bit cautious about what action you need to take because you need to handle all these things all these blessings that are coming to you so it's like this is material comfort so if you're looking about financial independence so it's like the problem of plenty so maybe you have some good finances flowing in and you do not know how to handle them or how to manage them and then there is this uh, ten of cups which is like the emotional part the everything seems to be overflowing over here it's like the completion of emotion so emotionally stable person is there in your life finances are coming your way and they are going to be much more than your expectations emotions are already filled with you so when filling you and you have a person with whom you have emotional stability so now where do you move from over here it's like suddenly you feel as if there is nothing more to be done or how either you feel that okay now i have received everything now i don't need any more so i become inactive or you can your inactivity could be due to the reason that you are overwhelmed by all these things that are come to you and you are unable to understand what to do with these things so you are not able to enjoy these blessings as much as you should have so all this money that you are getting uh, not just the money but some prosperity in different ways it could be in the form of some fame some recognition people acknowledging your work uh, all these things and, and suddenly you're like okay so does it end here now what, where do i move from over here on the emotional front also there's emotional stability for you so it's like when everything is going according to the plan or you're getting much more than what you had planned for then a kind of platitude comes in and you become i keep on using the word again and again it's like it's overwhelming you and as a result of that you are in unable to take any action which you should be taking to manage all these things that are there okay so now i am more stable financially so what is it that i need to do next now i have a stable family uh, i have the family support support of uh, my close ones and what do, how do i move ahead so it's the cup is overflowing so you need to give away that love this money you need to invest it in invest it in something so it's like this is piling up and you need to put it somewhere so that you can reap benefits from that and for that you will need to let go of your inaction and be more focused on these cards as compared to this card because this is where you presently seem to be where you are unable to decide on what needs to be done so uh, let us pick up a few charms as well and see where uh, what kind of uh, readings they give us it's like 1 2 3 and 4 okay so here we have a butterfly a key a skull and dagger and an angel over here right so butterfly butterfly is for metamorphosis for changes so it's not going to help you if you just keep on looking at the things that are over here so you need to go through a change you need to change your attitude and give yourself a wake up call and see uh, where this is going and invest all the money or the, all the good things that are there organize those things and work upon them now this vein boat is giving you the key as well as the skull and dagger so they are like pretty contradictory uh, they they might seem to be pretty contradictory uh, charms but the thing over here is if you connect to them you have found the key to your happiness but then there is the danger of getting too complacent in that and you start taking things for granted so do not do that so there is that danger when you get everything you start uh, taking everything for granted so that should not be the case and over here the angel the angel is there to help you out get off your uh, this uh, 
lazy period or this inactivity period so the divine help is there you just need to put your mind to that so these uh, four charms work with these cards in this way thank you for listening and i hope you were able to relate to this reading